guys, my name is Nicole and welcome to Nicole Topics and today's topic is a tutorial on how to open mini colored book rings. So literally a year ago, I was school supply shopping and I found these cute colored and mini book rings and I was like, you know what, this could be useful and I maybe I'll use it a lot during the year, which I did. But I couldn't help but notice that when I first got these, they were such a pain to open, like my hands were hurting. But over time, with more use to them, they became easier to open and I developed a strategy I'm going to show you guys today. So right here are book rings and they're colored and they're the ones that I haven't used. Why haven't I used these specifically? Well, I like to save the rings that are my favorite color. If I'm going to use rings that are my favorite color, they're going to be used for a good purpose. Because th that's, that's who I am. <laughs> so right now I am just going to open this up. And I am going to pick out this pink ring. And I'm going to close this and put this aside. And as you guys notice, it's, it's it's just a mini pink ring. I'm just gonna start with the basics first. So you first want to see find that little like corner diagonal thing that makes it like you know break off or basically whatever you call that thing. This this thing, that thing. You want to find that, and you want to use two hands for this. You want to have both of your thumbs here, not so far away from these, and your index fingers like parallel to your thumb zip. Now, once this becomes easier to open, you should be able to eventually easy, just easily like pull and you'll just open up. But since it's new, that's not gonna happen easily. So what I usually do with new rings is I put it on my palm and I rub it together and make sure it starts to warm up a little bit. Then I turn it and I do the same process again. I wanna, you wanna make sure this is really warm. Once it's really warm, do the handling thing again and start pushing. It should now be able to open like this. Once you have it open up, what I usually like to do is pull it as back as far as possible a few times, you know, get the stuff start grind, get used to grinding and going. Then before I close it, I'm gonna put these right here like this. Just like squeeze it and start doing this a little bit, you know. Try to get this ring used to moving around. And then that's when I'm gonna snap it back on. And I'm gonna do that whole process again. And as you guys see, it's now easy, it's now easy to open and close. Once it's easy to open and close, you can have this handy and dandy with you everywhere and you can even put it on index cards. Like, here is an example. Here is a summer presentation of, of index cards I have. And I can just easily open this, remove it, and then I can just open this, put it in, take it out again, this back on and yeah how about we try this again but with a different color let's try purple oh shoot okay purple so we're gonna do the same thing we just did in the beginning but quicker so you're gonna want to warm this up for a bit and there's no specific time of how much you want to warm it up like how much you have to rub your hands or though just just keep rubbing until you, the ring doesn't feel cold on your hands anymore. Then we want to do the, this thing. And you want to pull. It's going to take a while. Maybe a little bit of readjusting with your hands to do it. It's open. Get as much... Get this... Make this ring as used to moving as it possibly can. Then snap it back on, try it again, it's easy to open. And guys, that is my tutorial, I hope you guys like it, and yeah.
I've been wanting to make this book ring tutorial for months. But anyways, I hope this video helped you guys. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you in the next video. Cheerio!